Hey everybody, I'm here in Tampa, Florida at the Coral Corral. This place has got one of the most amazing display tanks filled with Acropora that I've ever seen. So let's go in and take a look. Right when you walk into the store, there's a 10-foot peninsula reef tank filled with Acropora. This tank uses AI lights and is very blue in its spectrum. Uh, like most of the large tanks that I've come across, they have to dose nutrients, nitrate and phosphate, uh, to keep levels where they want them. This tank has layers and layers of Acropora colonies, um, basically stacked next to and on top of each other. Um, it's got a row of stags down the middle that are just stunning. Uh, and they've just done an amazing job of combining colors and patterns and shapes uh, into a very pleasing look. I took a lot of inspiration away from this tank. I shot this video using the aquarium camera app. Uh, so the colors that you're seeing here, the blue tint, is pretty reflective of what's actually um, showing up when you're in the shop. Um, both sides of this peninsula are covered with Acropora. Um, there's a ton of millies in there and a ton of tenuous that are just really very, very shaggy, very hairy, and very stunning. Uh, they also have a couple other SPS, non-Acropora type colonies. There's some uh, Montes in there that are really impressive. Uh, it, it's just really amazing. Um, they use a lot of super glue uh, to mount their colonies, like the thick gel type super glue, and they move them around a lot uh, to get them in the places that they want to have them. This tank has been in operation for approximately 12 years, they told me. Uh, they've changed it around a number of times, uh, but you can really see that they've dialed this in beautifully. Uh, it's just truly stunning to stand in front of. I spent a number of hours in that shop over the weekend. Right next to the tank is another huge tank. This one has a big drop off on the end. Um, and as you can see in the sand bed, they've got a lot of LPS corals. Um, and then as you look at the, uh, the rock work, it's euphilia everywhere, um, torches and hammers and frog spawns galore. Um, I, I'm not somebody who's very expert in those types of corals, but I, I imagine that the value of these corals uh, is extreme. Uh, it's really stunning and worth, worth the visit. A little deeper in the shop, uh, we see another large tank. This one's filled with large angelfish and other big uh, big fish you're not going to see in a typical reef tank. Uh, it also is pretty impressive. The middle of the shop is filled with large coral tanks uh, that hold a lot of LPS uh, and soft corals for display and purchase. Going back to the main display tank, um, wanted to show some, some images of some of the impressive colonies. I spent uh, several days in that shop over the weekend uh, making my shopping list, researching uh, what it takes to bring coral home, uh, and was able to pick up uh, 13 pieces that I brought back with me. Uh, packed them in a soft side cooler I bought at Walmart. Uh, they packed them in small bags with uh, limited amounts of water, and TSA didn't even bat an eye uh, as they went through the scanning machine. So very simple to bring them home. Uh, they're all in the tank now, and I'm working on getting them placed uh, in my aquarium. So great time at Coral Corral in Tampa, Florida. If you're ever in the area, I highly recommend that you check it out. Uh, great people, great supplies, great coral. Uh, I had a blast. Take care and happy reefing.